Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Rita Okolo. If this is your first time tuning in, thank you so very much for joining us. If this is not your first time, thank you so much for coming back. So today, we are actually going to be doing a really simple, simple eyeshadow makeup look that brings so much drama and playfulness to the eyes, but at the same time takes literally five minutes to do. I wanted to kind of give you guys a different like option and different feel because not everybody has the time to sit there and literally be blending away and not everybody has necessarily the skills or the amount of shadows that I may have. So I wanted to give you guys a nice and simple option. I've used only three eyeshadows for this entire eye look, just three two in the crease and one right on the lid. But before we get into the tutorial, do not forget to like this video and to subscribe. Do subscribe to my channel. It does help to spread the word so that others can enjoy the same footage that you are enjoying as well. If you would also like to see a tutorial on the full face of makeup, I actually use the MAC times Patrick Star collection to do this look. I will link my review right here so you can go and check that out. All right, let's get into it. Okay, so to start off with, I'm going in with amber into the crease. Amber is a burnt red, and I'm using the Diffuse Crease Brush, the E38 from Sigma Beauty. I love how simple this eyeshadow look is. I'm just swishing this back and forth, just really building up the intensity of this color in my crease. Next, I'm gonna go in with Oud. Oud is like a plummy red shade, like a purpley brown, but with lots of red. It's a warm brown, a very warm brown. And I'm going in, I'm flicking this on the outer corner of my eye and dragging it inwards, flicking it to lift my eye. Just building the intensity on the outer corner and then whatever's left on the brush, I'm just brushing inwards. Next, we're gonna go in with the star of the show, which is Harpoon. It's this beautiful olive shade in the Desi XKD eyeshadow palette with Dose of Colors. Now I will be going in with my finger for this. So I'm just gonna take a clean finger. I'm going to spritz some Fix Plus on it. Just a bit there. And then I'm going to be going into the pan just rubbing my finger on it, on the eyeshadow to get the pigment onto my hand. Okay, and that's what it looks like. Now I'm gonna go onto my eye. So pigmented and so rich in pigment. Such a beautiful shade. The olive green really complements this um, burgundy wine transition that we do have going on the eye. And I'm just, Pressing this onto the skin, going from inner corner to outer corner. I first placed it in the center just to get the most amount of product. And then I'm just swiping it onto the lid. Going in with just a little bit more because I do want it a little brighter. This shade is so beautiful. And that, guys, is really the hardest part of this eyeshadow look. <laughs> that literally was just it. It's The combination is so perfect. I'm just going in with a detailer brush and a little bit of oud and just kind of going around the outer edge just to create a bit of shading and shadow and to kind of intensify the crease slightly. Just slightly. Next, I'm going to be going with the same detailer brush Going back in with Oud and Amber, okay, onto the brush. I'm just gonna drag the, these on my lower lash line. Next, going in with the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is my favorite mascara. I'm gonna be going in and coating my lashes. Next, I'm gonna be going in on my lower lash line and I'm going to be dragging this product. This is how I create a nice smoky effect without doing too much work. 
and I'm breaking the the wand, the mascara wand back and forth on my lash line and I'm allowing it to touch my skin. This way, without having to go in with any black eyeshadow or any darker shades, I'm able to deepen up and add a lot more drama to my lower lash line with a little work. It's like killing two birds with one stone. <laughs> you darken up your lash line and at the same time, you create a smoky effect. And last but not least, I'm going to pop on some eyelashes. Yep, and that's it for the eyeshadow look. Thank you so very much for watching this tutorial. I really do hope that you guys try out the eyeshadow look. And if you do, do let me know. I have left all my social media information down below. And also, all the information in terms of products and information as to where you can get products and links are down in the description bar. I really spend a lot of time writing out and typing out those things just to make sure that you guys have access to it. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Do not forget, you can check out a few of my other videos. I will link them right here for you to check out. Hope you do have a blessed holiday season. I hope to see you in another tutorial very soon. And until then, stay blessed and stay golden.